Anne with Practically Posh Life and today's video is going to be what I got my kids for Christmas stocking stuffers. So I'm so excited to be bringing you what they're getting in their stockings this year. Hi, I am Sam. If you are new, welcome. I have two girls, ages almost eight. She'll be eight two weeks before Christmas and one that just turned six in August. I do this series every year. Last year I, I got it done, but it was a struggle and I did not get the Hits and Misses video done. But this year I am committed, I am in a better space, and I'm hopeful that we can get all of the videos done. I am filming all of these back to back so you will see what I got my daughter for her eighth birthday, what I got my kids for Christmas this year, and then you will also see this video which is what I got my kids for Christmas in their stockings. So, without further ado, let's get started. As you all know, these are their forever stockings. Uh, and they are the Pottery Barn stockings that we use every year, so no change there. As I have mentioned, this was an investment, and so my husband's going to hold me to that investment until they are literally tattered. And fortunately, unfortunately, the quality of Pottery Barn products is so good that they literally look brand new. Like, not a seam, not a thread, they look amazing. So my oldest is Adriana, and my youngest is Isabel. So let's start with... Before I jump into their stockings, let me show you what I'm doing for their advent calendar this year. I'm not going to do a whole separate video just for advent calendar, so I'm going to add it into this one. This year, last year we went with LOL and they each had an LOL advent calendar, different ones, but two LOL calendars. This year I decided to go with Our Generation because they are still very much into their dolls and playing and I felt like the stuff that would come in the advent calendar for Our Generation would be things that they can add into the accessories that they play with their dolls with. These calendars are big, y'all. So here, here's the calendar. It is massive. I completely underestimated how big they were when I ordered them, but it's certainly gonna make a, a big impression. So it obviously has 24 days. Our elf will be coming on December 1st, and our elf will be bringing the advent calendar, so I am borrowing it until the elf comes, um, but, this is it, it has 24 doors, and then um, on the back, you can kind of see the outline of some of the things that are in here. I will read it to you. So you will have in here um, different tree decorations, you will have a hat, you will have shoes, uh, a wand, a comb, ice skates, um, little coffee cups, a pie, like just a ton of stuff that I know that they can play with their dolls with. Um, I was tempted to just get one of them, um, but anyone who has multiple kids, you, you already know how that, that was going to go. It, it wasn't. It wasn't going to go. So I just got two because we're trying to have a peaceful holiday season, and I don't, I don't need the headache. So we have two. So each girl will be getting their own Our Generation Advent Calendar. Um, and I really think they're going to enjoy it. I find that every year it gets harder and harder to find advent calendars because I don't want to get the same one. So this solved this year. Next year we'll have to see what happens. But really think that they're going to love that. So now let's jump into the stuff that's going to go in their stockings. I'm going to go through one thoroughly. And then the other one is going to be quick because it's mostly the exact same stuff. So first they're all going to get this color. They're both going to get this coloring book. It's just the Crayola cosmic cats and other uh, galactic things um, coloring book I got this at the Dollar Tree they are still really a fan of coloring pages and coloring books and so that's an easy one for me to just grab a coloring book and stick it in their um, stocking then I have this little backpack school set for one of them in their stocking and these little sets are cute they're about $7.99 I always get it when there's a sale on our generation stuff um, and these can fit right in their stocking Surprisingly, we have not gotten into the pop-it trend yet. They ask every time we're at the store and I say no. <laughs> um, but we got this Among Us pop-it off of Amazon that I think they're really gonna love. It's a large pop-it and it's in the shape of um, the little characters in Among Us and they like to play that game uh, online. So I think this will be fun. So I ordered that on Amazon with the Among Us theme. They're also going to get this little Among Us plushie so they each have one. This is going to be the one for my younger daughter. 
I got this baby born surprise mini. So I try to steer away from these surprise things. You'll notice this is the first year I'm not doing an LOL ball. I just, they're not into them anymore and I'm not into buying them anymore. So I, I did not buy any LOL stuff for them. So spoiler alert, if you go to my, um, what I got my kids for Christmas, there's not gonna be any LOL stuff in it. And it's just that they don't play with them as much anymore. So they're still cute, but I'm not gonna buy it if they don't play with them anymore. Um, they do love their baby born dolls, and so I thought they would enjoy the little surprises that have come out recently. And then they each got a bookmark. They are big readers, and so I thought these bookmarks, I ordered them on Etsy, um, are really cute. This one says reading changes everything, and then it just has um, this little cutie pie here. Um, who's just absolutely adorable and so I love these and I love when I can find things that have characters that look like them um, and so I'm always a fan of anytime I can see little little brown girls on anything because I, I want them to have a really positive self-image and it's really fun when you see people who look like you um, so this is gonna be their bookmark honestly we are always losing bookmarks right now they are both using post-its for bookmarks and in, in their books that they're reading um, so they're gonna be excited to get a new bookmark and then the rest candy so we did the build a snowman again I did the holiday fruit snack pack and um, there's another thing I just don't know where it is then they also got the holiday hubba bubba and was it Easter maybe it was Easter Oh, it was Halloween. Halloween, they got their first hubba bubba. I know, I know, it's late, but I just was like paranoid about them choking on gum, so they never were allowed to chew gum. And so I finally like allowed them for Halloween to try gum, and they get the concept, they're not choking on it, they're fine. Um, but they think they're so cool with these hubba bubbas. They were like, they'll pull out a piece and then they'll put it away. And so the one from Halloween is still going, because um, they're allowed like some right after school, and they just. They think they're so cool. So they're gonna be excited to get another one that has a Christmas theme. So that is everything. Um, we will also stick in there a Roblox gift card for the both of them. Um, maybe a Target gift card. So, oh, and, um, and just chargers. They're at that age where charging cords are a gift. <laughs> so it's gonna be it's gonna become like the new socks and underwear like they're getting charging cords and so we will get some charging cords and stick it in their stocking as well but that is everything i have yet to try to see if this stuff fits in the stocking so i'm just going to test it out with one of them um just so that you guys can quick see for the other child everything is the same except her bookmark looks a little different it says leaders read and then it has this little cutie pie on it for her little Our Generation set, I got the lunch tray set. My younger daughter took her tooth fairy money and bought this, and my older daughter is totally jealous and was like, I wish I could have gotten that. And so she'll get this in her stocking. This is her little Among Us plushie. Interesting looking. Um, and then everything else is the same. The coloring book, all the candies, they're all the same. So let's try to see if this actually quick fits in here. I think it will, but let's take a quick look. Okay, the coloring book, it fits, but it ain't pretty. Okay, I'm gonna make it work. I should have probably stuffed it beforehand and then just shown you the full stocking, but you're gonna get to see this with me. I will do a better job of like sorting it out later. But for right now, I'm just trying to see if it fits. Okay, guys, it fits. Everything fits. We always have the stuffed animal or plushie poking out the top. And so I will organize this better, but everything fits. And I will organize it so it kind of goes into the toe. But this is what it will look like, a neater version of it when it's done. But everything fits perfectly. And the only thing that's not here is just a charging cord. Um, and a couple of gift cards. But otherwise, that is everything that is gonna be in their stocking, and I think they are going to love all of it, and I'm glad I didn't do too many, like, tchotchkes, um, because I don't find that they use them. They're already overloaded on Christmas anyway. Um, so I tried to get things that they can either consume, like treats and candy, um, or, like, things like these, where I know they're gonna use it. 
but not a lot of like Dollar Tree or Dollar Spot items anymore because I just know that they're, I'm just gonna have them for next year. They never end up opening them because they get distracted with all their gifts. Um, so hopefully this gave you some ideas of uh, stocking stuffers for kids. Around that, I would say most of this stuff can range from like four to eight, four to 10. Um, variations of it but I think a lot of this stuff is universal for several different ages so hopefully you found it helpful and I will see you in the next video make sure that you subscribe and like this video um, so that you can see all the rest of the videos in this series I'm not sure what order you will see them in but you'll know which order I filmed them in because I'm gonna get subsequently like more sweaty and like disheveled as these go because I have to keep digging through the closet to pull all this out um, so I'm filming the what I got my kids for Christmas next and it's gonna be a lot of movement of boxes um, so we'll see all right but I look forward to seeing you in the next video and thank you so much for watching today